Hey there, Lick and Riffers, and welcome back to another awesome guitar video here on Lick and Riff, in which I have the incredible luck and the immense pleasure to show you a baritone guitar. A baritone guitar has been a personal dream of mine for, I think, close to a decade. And now I'm finally holding one, thanks to Faith Guitars. Um, this is less of a promotional video, honestly, than just a video of me being excited about having a baritone guitar, holding it in my hands. Um, because Faith released a baritone guitar this year. And they, they emailed me and asked me, uh, would you like to showcase it to your audience? And I was like, would I? Um, and, and I wrote back, of course, of course I would. Sure, yes, I would be delighted. Um, and my heart was pounding and I was like, oh my God, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna finally play a baritone guitar. Um, so this is me excited. So the baritone guitar is a slight, uh, slightly larger scale guitar. Uh, the neck is, is longer than a normal guitar uh, and the body is slightly larger. It's, um, it's, it's a large guitar, but it's very convenient as well. But the amazing thing about this guitar About, about baritone guitars is the sound. It's tuned a fourth lower than a normal guitar. It's somewhere between a normal guitar and a bass. It's not as low as a bass and it's lower than a normal guitar. So it's kind of the missing link if, if you think about it. Now, nothing you play on this guitar will ever sound happy, no matter what. No matter what you play, will ever sound happy. This is a somber guitar. It's a, it's a thoughtful guitar. It's a guitar for bass. For bass soloing, for, for remorse, for weird chords, for harmonies, for background, for interesting. Sinister music. At least that's how I see it. Try to play blues on it. And it's still sad. Everything you play on this guitar sounds important. Everything sounds important. There's no, there's no simple note when you play a baritone. I'm playing a C chord, but it's not, it's not C, it's now G. Um, when do you have, have you ever heard a sadder G chord? Yeah, I don't know why I'm, I'm stuck on, the, on, on E minor, which is now B minor. But let's let's try to play something different so you can hear. It. Hey, you see, you can play chords, but you have to be really careful. You can. But but it, it's it's such a wonderful 
feeling to be able to produce such an important sound. I, I've got no better word for it. It's, it's an important sound. Even when you play D. Okay, the D. The D chord. Okay, because all the strings are thick, okay, you have literal bass strings here with very thick high strings because they're not high their middle strength, then even the high notes on this guitar can sound important, okay, so because they're not thin sounds. And uh, as I showed you, even playing the normal A, A minor, let's try to... gets a completely new interpretation, right? Um, and if I, okay, you can it, it, you can think of the of the baritone guitar. Everything gets a new interpretation here. Uh, you can think of the baritone guitar as the cello of the guitar world. Um, because it's not a violin, it's not high, and it's not a double bass, it's not low, it's, it's somewhere in the middle. You can think of it as, as, as the cello. Uh, how does it go? The... Okay, if you try to play this on a normal guitar, you don't get that much of a of a resonance, but if you if you play the you know what let, let me let me search for the tab and uh, okay Bach cello cello concerto number one right uh, prelude tab hey Okay, I think we can trust Songster. Uh, it looks like the most promising tab, and it's in drop D. Unsurprisingly, because most of the Bach arrangements are in drop D. At least the ones that I've encountered. Which is now drop A. What a low bass. So. Like a, ba a a bass guitar and a guitar playing together, right? So don't know what I was thinking with that with that with that vibrato there. Okay, so the cello of the guitar world. Right. 
yeah, it's A over G. diminished chord. Bach, and um, that's the baritone guitar. Yeah, that's it. beauty so this is the baritone guitar for me it's a dream come true um, so thank you very much for watching thank you very much faith for sending me this beauty um, and uh, I will see you the next lesson bye for now thank you <laughs>